If your Sony Bravia Google TV's remote is not working, not responding, there's no light when you use the microphone, even with new batteries, maybe some button works like voice control or power button, then stay tuned and I'll show you how to fix your slow, laggy, unresponsive or stuttering Sony Smart TV remote. First, we will start by cold booting the TV. It's very effective and may just end up fixing your problem. So unplug your TV's power cord and you need to wait at least 5 minutes before turning it on. And while you're waiting, also take out the remote batteries. After 5 minutes, reinsert the batteries and turn your TV back on. If it's still not fixed, then we'll try resetting the remote and repair it with the TV. To do that, you'll need to press down the volume down button and then hold down the voice command button until you see the LED flashing. This means your remote is now reset and has disconnected itself from the TV. If you don't see the pairing LED, then it's probably because your remote's batteries are drained. Now try pressing any buttons and you should connect back to your TV once again. But in your case, if the remote doesn't pair back to the TV automatically and only the infrared works, then bring up the quick menu by pressing down the home button, go to all settings, scroll down and select remotes and accessories, then select Sony TV VRC and hit unpair, press ok. Now to add it back, go to remote control, select connect via bluetooth, then follow the same pairing process as shown before. Now your remote should connect via bluetooth and you'll be able to use it without the infrared. Now, if you have issues with your remote buttons, where some of the buttons are unresponsive, or the remote doesn't work at all, then you need to check if the remote itself is functioning or not by testing the infrared. Beforehand, you need to unplug your TV once again. Then open your phone's camera, point your remote at it, press all your remote's buttons one by one. You should see the infrared light flashing whenever you press a button. This way, you'll be able to identify the buttons that are not working. If you found out that some buttons are not working, it may be caused by some dust buildup. And if none of the buttons are working, there's no infrared, and you have already tried using fresh batteries, then either way your remote will need repairs. You can either contact Sony support for further assistance, or you can just visit a technician. In the meantime, take a minute to look at this video where I show you how to use your smartphone as your Sony Smart TV remote with no downside. That's all for this video, help us improve by leaving your feedback down below, drop a like, get subscribed and I'll see you in the next one.